Hello, all you hardcores out there. How are we doing? It's Russ here from Porker's Corner. Biggest gob in sport. You know that. Right. Yui Fury. We've opened up a can of worms, haven't we, on my channel? Yui saying that he ices Wilder and he's done a few interviews since the other YouTube channel saying that he'll knock Joshua out because he's a complete big stiff. And I back him all the way. Is that bad? I've got to see Yui spar loads of it for years, and I think he's a great fighter. 28 years old. Now, people keep abusing me, and he's got to a stage where I'm going to do a reply to all this abuse, because it gets you all going, doesn't it? I know how to push buttons in you all now. Right. Yui's about 10 years younger, and he's nine, 10 years younger than Joe Joyce. Right. So it's plenty of time, isn't there? He's got three losses on his record. He lost to Parker. I thought he were robbed. Everybody thought he were robbed. And only a baby then, won he? Right. He lost to Pooler. He got a bad cut in sparring. I was there, Martin McCauley. I seen it. Four week out. Massive, massive bad cut. They rolled the dice. Because this is how boxing is. If he didn't roll the dice, he'd have been waiting forever. They rolled the dice. And it, the cut opened up, didn't it? And he lost on points. Game plans are to win when you get cut very, very early in a fight. With round one, end of round one, early round two. Bad, bad cut. But yeah, people feel that because you he doesn't put his son about on social media that they can abuse anybody who says, you know what? He was a good fighter. You know what I mean? But he's 28 years of age. Look at the experience he's got. And obviously, he lost to Povetkin. Hey, I had him lose him to Povetkin. And so did his dad. And we spoke about this many times. But let me tell you this. Povetkin, former world champion, he only had one defeat on his record then. I think they need to Vladimir. Might have been one or two. I'm not sure we aren't looking. But he'd been beaten by Vladimir, I think, at the time. And uh, Yui Fury lost to, to Povetkin. He got old man, but he put Dylan White to kip, didn't he, after that, Povetkin? Put him to kip. Right? Put Dylan White to kip. So, as far as I'm concerned, it's going to take experience from that fight, isn't it? He? He'd been robbed, he's been cut, and he got old man. Robbed, cut. Cut to shreds, an old man. That stands him in good stead for moving forward. You can't buy that. Yeah, it's crap to lose, isn't it? You know, when you're putting all your effort in, but just because you always come out and he said, look, do you think you'll beat song? So what do you want him to say? Oh, no. Big Doss of Femi beats me. While the flattens me. Do you want you to come out and say that? What fighter have you ever heard come out and say, Oh, he beats me, but I'll take five. You've never heard it. It's like you've never heard a fighter say, I've had a shit camp. They always say, best camp ever, isn't it? It's a cliche. Like I said, the abuse. It's like the abuse for Yui and the Carl Frotch. It's unbelievable. Why? I don't. People have got a lot of time on their hands. That's what I say, but I believe Yui will win a world title. 28 years of age, there's plenty of time. Plenty of time. Derek Chisori didn't want to fight you, did he? Dylan White's not fought him. All right? And I can assure you that Joshua probably didn't want to fight him because he'd be chasing shadows all night. And we know Joshua's even scared of his own shadow. So what's he going to do when you is putting it on him? Pop, pop, bang. You know what I mean? Picking away at him, picking and poking all night long. And moving out of the way. It's called the sweet science. Hit and not get hit. You know, like a fighter jet, when it comes in, it does the business and gets back out, doesn't it? Sweet science. All right? So keep the abuse coming, but just replying to it all. Just letting you all know. People keep saying, oh, we've been beat by so-and-so. But go and look at it. Go and look at them fights. Robbery. Come on, you can't tell me that Parker won that fight. You can't tell me that. Come on. He got robbed. Isn't that right, Terry O'Connor? 
Hey? You know what went on there, don't we? He got robbed in that fight against Parker. Um, we know the rest, don't we? The pool left, bad cut. And, you know, Povetkin. I would say he got beat against Povetkin. That old man, but he'll learn from that. But I think the abuse is terrible. Some of, I'm going to save some of them, actually, some of them emails. And then when he does win a world title, like I said, this is what you said. This is what that person said. So, all right. So, one of them things, and it's uh, it's one of them things. But what can you do? It's boxing, and it? it's very subjective. And we all have an opinion on it, don't we? It's the only sport where we all got our knickers in a twist in it, you know. But he said, she said, or he beats him, or he should fight him. All keeps it going, doesn't it? Keeps the storyline going. But I believe Yui wins the world title. He's young enough, he's experienced enough, so get off his back, man, and get behind the kid. He's from UK. You know what I mean? Using him like that, man. Sickos, sickos. All right, so peace out. Keep on trucking, keep sporting boxing. Don't have nightmares. All right? That includes you a lot. Keep trolling me regarding Yui. All right?